Hello. The beginning of spring was the beginning of our gardening year here at Homegrown Veg in the United Kingdom. And I sold some potatoes in 10 inch X good flower water buckets. But because it was the beginning of spring and there was a chance of a late frost, I stood all of those buckets in my 8 foot by 6 foot polycarbonate greenhouse. I could do that because the greenhouse was empty. But as we moved through spring and the danger of frost disappeared, I started moving some of those buckets out. And ultimately, I moved them all out with the exception of two buckets. I moved them all out because I needed room to put tomato plants in there. Let me cut you back to a delivery I did a couple of days ago and this is from one of the buckets that started life in the greenhouse but has, has spent most of its time outdoors. Check out the weighing then come back to me. Okay, let's see what we've got. One potato in, a 10 inch, ex cut flower water bucket, a variety of the potato, jelly. What do you make that? That's got to be just shy of a pound and a quarter. Hey, let's call it a pound and a quarter for argument's sake. One in, a pound and a quarter out. Come on, come on, that's a result. And they're all sound potatoes. They'll all be eaten. Probably today. <laughs> potatoes don't get any fresher than that. Okay, so as you could see, that potato was a potato called jelly. Now, one of the two potato plants that is still in the greenhouse is a potato called jelly. We're going to take those plants out of the greenhouse today, and I'll explain why when we go in the greenhouse, and I'm going to turn jelly out. And the reason I cut you back to that last piece of video was, we've got a comparison, we've got a trial going on here. It wasn't a trial I intended, it just happened. We've got a plant that's grown most of its time outdoors and we've got a plant that's grown exclusively all of its time indoors. It's still in the greenhouse. It's never been outdoors, it's been mollycoddled. And we'll see if there's a difference. We'll do a weighing and see if those potatoes uh, grow better in a greenhouse or grow better outdoors. It's only a small trial but it was never intended to be a trial but it's a trial nevertheless right let's go out to the greenhouse come on these two potato plants are in the way now they're growing in x 10 inch cut flower water buckets one's called nectar the other's called jelly They've been in this greenhouse over the whole of our United Kingdom spring. That's March, April and May. I've filled the greenhouse up now with tomatoes down the sides, but I need that end of the greenhouse for my cucumber plants, which I have and should be on station, but they're not, and they're not on station because those two potatoes are in the way. So they've got to come out of this greenhouse now. Now they've had three months and I'm fairly sure these two varieties probably need longer than that. Possibly four months, maybe longer than that. But both of them have flowered so they're there or thereabouts. So we're going to get them out of the greenhouse now. We're going to get those cucumbers on station and that's everything done and dusted for this year. All we look for now is a good crop of tomatoes, a good crop of cucumbers and something on the bottom of those two plants. 
Right, let's get them out of the greenhouse. This is jelly grown exclusively in a greenhouse. It's only just come out today and we're going to harvest it. So it's never actually been outdoors until today. Looks a similar sort of load to me. Looks about equal. Yeah, let's take it indoors and weigh it. What was the other one? A pound and a quarter. I think we've probably got a pound and a quarter there. Yeah. Yep. Yep. I'm sure there'll be a pound and a quarter there. Come on, Meg. Let's go indoors. Okay. Let's weigh these potatoes. That's it, just about a pound. So there's been no benefit for this potato plant growing in a greenhouse. Hey, look at these. Look at all those small ones, all those mollies. 
There's a couple of dogs outdoors. I think they would uh, enjoy one or two of these each. Don't think they'll do them any harm. They're not as big as your thumbnail. Yeah, so we'll take these outdoors. We'll give the dogs a treat. Um, we get a pound from jelly grown in the greenhouse. Pound and a quarter from jelly grown outside the greenhouse in the garden. I think that's about a draw, isn't it? We're not going to split hairs, are we, over a quarter of a pound? Ah, it's about the same. Okay, let's take these uh, mollies outside, give the pups a treat, call it a day. Hey, what's this? Well, sit, sit. Well. Good girl, is that nice? Move over. Daisy, come in. Daisy. Off for you. Good girl. Let Meg. Off for Meg. These really are very small. They are. They are really very small. Not as big as your fingernail, look. They're not going to harm a dog. Daisy. Meg. Last one for Daisy. All gone. Did you enjoy that, pups? <laughs> Did you enjoy that? Did you? Yeah, you did. <laughs> so this is homegrown veg. Signing out. <laughs>